I'm just grateful that you know I I'm able to play football just like any other normal you know able-bodied players. My passion started. I played in the you know the junior team. I played in the Milo Spec. So they grew up. I played in the youth team, uh, national under 12, under 13, under 14. Yeah, represented for Singapore in the youth time. Huh? There was one player from Tanjo Paga last time. For me, he was my inspiration. His name is Hakan. It was years back. I met him here. When I see him, the first time I see him, I thought, like, if he can play, that time I was 12 years old. Why I can't play in the professional league? What I've been through, I think the opponents of my players or my friends, if they play with me, so they just treat me just like any normal players. I want them to treat me just, you know, like any other opponents, you know. If they want to give me heart in the field or what, I'll just accept, accept it, you know. When I was you. I mean, smaller, younger days. It's not just tackling, you know, sometimes, you know, they will call you names or what, you know. At first, when I was young, yeah, maybe it's a bit sensitive for me, so, but for me, as I get older, I get more mature, I think I just want to play and just show to all the normal people that I'm just like any other, uh, any, any other person, you know. It was a dream to come to Tanjung Paga because last time, when I remember, you know, I came here and took photo with Hakan. I just thought one day, you know, why, yeah, I want to be like him, you know, I want to represent Tanjung Paga. I would like to say, you know, many, many thanks, first of all, to Terry Park Manadan. Terry come and talk to me, say, you want to come and Tanjung Paga, I say, why not? I just get, I don't, I don't care what team, but I just want to play football, you know. And I also like to thank, uh, you know, to this uh, GM, Francis for giving me support and all the players here, you know, for treating me very nice.